Hello, my name is Elson Silva. I got my PhD at Pennsylvania State University and I have a, a special proposal to Penn Staters. As you see, Bill Clinton, he was the speaker of my commencement and Eva Spenard was there in 1996. And uh, Bill Clinton said on my PhD that I was a privileged citizen of receiving the highest education that American institutions can provide and that in the future we would be creating jobs never ever imagined before and I think that's maybe true because after I came back to my country and I've been uh, facing this honesty in my institution they just uh, fired me one year afterwards and I didn't mind because I have a scientific discovery to pursue and I got this issued patent this patent is a breakthrough uh, bringing a hydrology, hydrogeology to the patent system. What happens is people in the patent system, they are not respecting hydrology. And uh, I got the two uh, American patent attorneys, partners of my patents, and they suggest me to fight the patent sending IDS and ask people to respect it. But after some time, they re request me to stop and they said, okay, also, we are out of this project because the U.S. is a country that the big guys, they spoil the small guys, doesn't care who you are. So U.S. legal system doesn't work. And what happens now in Penn State is a proof of this. Ten years, fifteen years, you see a, a sex predator has been raping boys and nothing happened. So what happened is my partners, they quit the project. They own 45% of this patent that they quit it. So my proposal to Penn State is the following. I'm going to give Penn State 45% of my scientific discovery if you join me in this fight for honesty because we have to fight with the USPTO to respect issued patents, to respect inventors, to respect the science and also my patents be reinvented sometimes shamefully for patents that even doesn't work it doesn't respect hydrology okay so Americans you have a very big fight ahead the rape is much bigger than imagine because you are becoming broken you are losing jobs you are becoming obese and even you are violating science and the institutions in the US are becoming uh, malfunctioning is Penn State, is USPTO. So my suggestion is you join me and there is a room I am proposing a uh, creation of uh, a science I call hydro technology to bring this to the artificial porosity of ropes. You see we, we have a special porosity here that allows uh, all the change in hydrology from granular porosity to a more advanced flexible porosity so uh, if the patent system works there is room here for 200,000 new patents because this one technically this invalidates 50,000 patents and this is my fight it's been very difficult but if you join me I promised you the 45% of my patent attorney they quit. I will give you the institution and we are going to develop a new science and try to mend America to a more brilliant future where our main fight is just honesty. Okay? I will be in contact and uh, this will uh, be valid until 2024 and there is room for 200,000 new patents but this only can be achieved if we make US PTO to work and respect the law and respect science and respect issued patents so if you watch my videos to bark to be ARC you're going to know more about me and about my project because uh, you will be inspired you see you have to do jogging we have to it fruits because you've been groomed to divert for your humanity. Okay, bye bye.